Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Thank you guys so much for tuning into this brand new video. I hope you guys are all doing well and you've had an amazing Christmas and obviously Happy New Year to you guys. This is my first video of 2024 and as you guys can tell by the title, I am revealing my walk-in wardrobe. So I recently bought a three bedroom house and I turned the third bedroom into my walk-in wardrobe slash beauty room slash content room and this is basically going to be my safe space the room where i spend most of my time this literally will be it so i'm going to basically show you guys around at the moment there's literally nothing but the wardrobe and the table and the chest of drawers in this room there's no chair there's no rug there's no like decorative pieces in here so i'm just basically showing you guys how it looks bare and then i'll start putting in all my clothes in and then i'll do another video later on down the line when i've got all my decorated pieces in i've started putting the lights in and all of that at the moment this is just like a basic basic tour and i'll also be sharing with you guys the price of my wardrobe and the price of my table and the price of any other furniture that i got in here i will be sharing with you the price and all of these items i did get from ikea so that's where i got it from and then i'll show you guys around and give you guys all the necessary details so let's get started so this is the room from the door so as you walk in you have the wardrobe side on this side um so on this section of the wardrobe i'm going to put like long dresses or long coats here on this side and then down here i'm going to put in my trousers so this is like a trousers rack which you can pull out like so and then that will basically be there i don't know what i'm going to put underneath just yet i don't know if it's just going to be my trousers and i'm going to leave that space bare but i'm still trying to figure it out um and as you move along so this section here i'm going to put in like my blazers my tops short dresses and things like that i'll be putting up here um and then obviously we have this display section here which you can put things on top but i think i'm going to leave this place um bare because the things obviously will be coming down to this section right here if not i will still leave it um leave it bare because obviously i want to be able to see what's inside the drawers so this section right here is my favorite part of the whole wardrobe so um i think this section is like for watches and then here's like sunglasses and then here i have no idea and then here obviously your jewelry so necklaces and rings in this section so i don't know what i'm going to put in this kind of section but i already know that like my sunglasses will be in here i don't know if i'm going to have two trays of sunglasses right now i only own two pairs of sunglasses so literally it's going to just be one two um, um i don't know what to put in here but i think here's like watches not sure um, and it's got the soft clothes situation going on and obviously the rest are just drawers like this very basic very straight to the point and obviously soft clothes already um, the bottom drawer I've started to put all my wigs and hair collection so these are all my wigs that I've had over the years and I still have more wigs to kind of sort out i've got boxes upon boxes of wigs that i need to kind of figure out where they need to go but these are the ones that are in bags like this that i've just put in the bottom drawer um and then i'll figure out where they're all going at the moment so let's move on to the next section so the next section is this section right here where they we just have like shelves unit here um i'm thinking of maybe putting my bags in some of these shelves um and then kind of figuring out what else to put also i want i want to put my wigs in one of these shelves as well but i just don't know i don't know i don't know how it will look i'll put stuff in and then i'll start moving things around depending on how it looks um i need this to be so seamless so organized i don't want it to look cluttered i've just thrown things in without you know thinking about it so We'll see. At the moment, I'm thinking bags, wigs, um, and obviously down in this section here, 
is where you put your shoes. So these are like shoes section. So you can put your shoes back there, shoes front, um, the front here, um, and shoes along here. So here, I think I can fit about one pair, one pair, one pair, one pair, like four pairs per drawer, um, which is going to help me out. I'm going to put all my nice shoes here and all the other shoes that I can't fit here. I'm going to see whether I can buy something that I, that can go in this gap because obviously the wardrobe couldn't extend to the size of my wall. So I could only get kind of only these three sections because my wall wasn't big enough. So at the moment on this side of the room, we just have my filming equipment. So I've got my very, very old tripod here, uh, my ring light bag. This is my tent for when I go outside to film content. I need to change, my tent is there. And then I've got my little boxes of like makeup and other content bits. So at the moment, that's what this space is being used for. Like my ring light after I finish using it will go there. Right, so if we turn around, as you can see here, so this is going to be my dressing table also from Ikea. I've seen so many people get the one where it's like the slit, the, what's it called? The thing at the top with the drawers on both sides. So the beauty of this dressing table compared to the other ones I've seen is the fact that it has this draw so i wanted a draw like this so that i can organize all my makeup and all my brushes and just have them all here without actually having to have two tables on the side because obviously the space i have minimal space in here it's a very small room so i decided to get this one where i can just literally store all my makeup here so the plan at the moment obviously is a mess i've just kind of shoved things in here so the plan is to get like organizers like these well these are not organizers these are like old drawers that i've just kind of put in here but i want to get organizers and put loads of organizers in here and then have sections for everything so like have sections for my concealer have sections for my powders have sections for my brushes have sections for my eyelashes have sections for like foundation lip glosses and everything everything will have its own section in here it'll be very well organized so let's move on to this drawer right here so i needed like a drawer section so that I can keep all my bits and bobs. So like my products, my hair items, my skincare things, extra makeup that can't fit in here. Like I just needed this kind of situation so that I've got extra space. So at the moment, I've thrown things in here. So let's start from the bottom. So I've just basically thrown in some products in here, which like I said, I will organize. I'm gonna get like little sections and compartments and organize all of that this is my skincare drawer so i put all my wipes all my skincare bits and bobs are in here um this is my hair stuff so my hot comb hair dryer my hair bag this is just a random drawer hair drawer with all my brushes and another random drawer i will organize all of these drawers and make it look a lot nicer so this is basically the room as it looks now um the lights all the light bulbs are not in but this is the situation with the lights i very i really like what we decided to do in here um these lights we got from Danel. it's the same light style in bedroom number two um so yeah so once this room is done it will look so nice i need a chair obviously for my dressing table i need a mirror i need a nice rug i need a nice curtain situation there i need some decorative pieces for my windowsill i need some lights for the walking wardrobe i just need a lot of things like there's a lot of things that need to be added to this room so that it looks a lot nicer but yeah that is basically the tour of the room how it looks plain plain and simple um and oh yeah i said i'm gonna tell you guys the prices of everything so let me do that before i start organizing and adding all my bits i've got all my pricing here so i don't forget so this whole setup right here um the wardrobes it cost me 583 pounds for just this right here that you see behind me. 
this is how much it cost um for my tables where's the price for that let me just grab the price for my tables okay so i managed to find the rest of the information on my phone so the chest of drawers that you see over there they were 129 pounds and then the dressing table that you see over here this was 99 pounds so um i will add the links for the dressing table and the chest of drawers it's very hard for me to add the link of this because obviously this was designed i went in store and they put the designs together i gave them the measurements of the room i had to measure like ceiling to floor wall to wall how much the gap was from like the radiator to there like i had to literally measure everything um i tried to do it myself online but i just didn't want to get anything wrong so you can do it online on the ikea website but i decided to go in store um and have like a professional do it for me because i didn't want you know this arriving and it didn't fit um so yeah just make sure you get your measurements right if you are planning to get one of these done but yeah all the links for the um, dressing table and that chest of drawers will be available in the description box below but it's time for me to actually start putting all my clothes in so let's move on to that part of this video Love Love it. see ya say hello So I just wanted to quickly show you guys the hangers that I recently purchased. So these are from um, TK Maxx. So there's different shades. So this is like a darker beige. I don't know if you guys can see by the camera. And this is like a lighter beige. I don't know if you guys can see the difference. But yeah, I've got these from TK Maxx. And these will basically be the hangers that I'll be using for this walking wardrobe. I want everything to look seamless and everything to look uniform. Um, I can't remember the price, but I will be going out to get more. And once I get more, I will, tell, I will definitely share the price with you guys. So yeah. I have finished organizing and bringing all my clothes and bags and shoes and jewelry and putting them in the wardrobe um, it took a long time for me to actually do like all of this and put everything in I didn't know it was gonna take me that long but I had to literally organize I had to move things from suitcases things from boxes and literally basically unpack and put everything 
in the wardrobe and I've done that now so I'm just gonna turn the camera over and quickly show you guys what it looks like with all the bits and pieces inside the wardrobe okay so everything is in so let's start from this section I put all my long dresses uh, my long cardigans anything long I put in here and then down here I put some trousers jeans etc etc um, and then moving along I put on this side my scarves and then my jackets my blazers um, and then obviously some tops over here um, and in this drawer I started to put in some jewelry sunglasses as you guys can see I don't have that many things um, it's looking very very empty but I had a few rings and some necklaces and some other pieces of jewelry uh, these are the only sunglasses that i own these two and there's actually one more but it's in my suitcase downstairs these are my glasses that i use when i'm working and obviously my watch and that's basically it um in the other drawers i'm not even going to go into too much detail so i put my tops in here skirts shorts some spare trousers in there and here i put like holiday clothes like bikinis yeah it's all a mess bikinis um cover-ups anyway any holiday stuff i put in here and like i said all my hair stuff is in here i've put all my shoes here I've actually managed to fit quite a few shoes on these racks um, but yeah it's looking very nice color coordinated I try to put all the nudes together the whites together all the colors at the bottom but yeah these are not all my shoes some are still in a box because they all can't fit here and then I put all my bags in this section here this was a gift that I got um, as a wedding present and I thought this would just look nice just sitting here at the front and then I got all my other bags here and then in this section up here my wigs 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 so all those boxes there's wigs in each and every single box and then I just covered the mess at the back with this box here because I think it looks nice with that box just sitting there um i'll turn you guys around so my perfume set that was in my old house when i lived at my mum's i don't know if you guys remember this in previous videos i've just put this up here for now i don't know what i'm going to do with that whole situation um and this mirror i had when i lived back at my mum's i just basically put it here for now um i don't think i'll be keeping it i feel like i want something different i've had this mirror for a very very long time and I need a change but yeah I've just put it here for now this drawer like I said I'm gonna get everything organized get little containers and organ okay sorry guys my battery died but like I was saying this is all gonna be organized properly and then on this side I've just basically thrown in a lot of a lot of stuff I'm not gonna go through it but yeah these cupboards are now filled but yeah that's basically the room oh yeah this mirror is not staying um this is an old mirror that i had back at my mum's um once i find a really nice mirror this will be replaced but yeah that's basically it dior's there just chilling so that is all for today's video thank you guys so much for tuning in and i hope you guys have enjoyed it i will be posting an updated um walking wardrobe tour when i have a chair when i have a rug when i've bought a mirror basically when i've done the space up and you know added lights etc i will do an updated tour so please do you know stick around and watch out for that video when it comes out also subscribe to the channel if you're not subscribed already and if you've enjoyed this video please give it a thumbs up but that's it for today and i'll see you guys in my next video which will hopefully be soon